Hello guys, welcome back to another video on my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a Lego review of the Lego set 60257 or the service station. So let's get into it. So the first thing I'm going to be reviewing, if I pull it a little closer, is the actual like gas station part of it, and not the gas pump, but the like gas station. So we can see up here that it has octan. Uh, it's got the playability, so no finished off walls, just like the building in here. So on, if I move it closer, you can see it's like a table, the newspaper, and then there's like a cash register with a hot dog, TV with like soccer or something coffee machine then I, f I like the angle that they did on this along with like the vend or the electric charger which is kind of cool and then hold on for the minifigure we have the cashier um I like the uh, colors blue they used then he's got an octane badge back printing no arm printing or leg printing. So that's the main gas station. Next, I have the car, which if there's an electric plug-in, I assume this is electric and not gas. But um, it's kind of cool. It reminds me of like a tuner car type thing. I would set it on the ground, but the angle feels kind of bad, so I gotta you know pick it up and stuff. License plate. There's a lady in it. There's also a little chihuahua. I'll show you the actual minifigures in a minute. I like the tires. It, hold on, if I put it back here, I drop something, whatever. It rolls pretty nice. Back bumper, I pretty, I liked pretty much. So, um, I'm just gonna leave this here for a minute and frame. You guys can look at that stuff. Oh, and I'm fixing the thing that fell. Sorry about shaking the table. Okay, so the next thing is the uh, gas pump on. So um, you can see there's two gas pumps along with some uh, printing. You can see it there with like the gas. There's also the registers. I'll show you the other side in a second. So, um, Obviously, for say the van, I haven't showed you it yet, but it can pull up. And then these gas pumps right here can come off these clips. And you can plug it in on this somewhere, I think. Or you can just do that just because. And pretend to fill it up with gas. Here, I'll give you a close up of like, some of the printing. Here's the back. It's just got a rack with a buckle in it. Buckle what? bucket and shovel so uh yep put that back there put the car pulling up to it uh, next I'll show you this octane sign it's just one of those window frame pieces and then stickers on either side with octane so it's pretty simple but cool in case you didn't know the set will be going in my Lego city it's honestly probably going to turn into just an add-on to my other gas station, but still. Um, I got to show you the figures in this car still, so. Oh yeah, the set also came with the phone. So here's a little chihuahua. So that's pretty cool. Then there's this minifigure. I'm shaking a lot, so I can't really focus, but there we go. Come on. And then the last thing I have is the van. So, on, if I, I'll get the compartments open quickly. Cause I already kind of, you're all actually, I need to show you it first. There's the van. Yep, 
There we go. So I got the compartment open. It kind of just shows you the inside. Surfboard's up here. The roof comes off. I like the look of this van. It's like a really old like party van type thing. It's pretty cool. Not a lot of studs exposed. I like this. Favorite parts of that little stickers. I take the roof off quickly. Hold on. You can see the interior. Which appears to just be like a kitchen and some seats. So minifigure number one in here is um hold on. Is this lady? Uh, green sweat. I don't really like the green sweatshirt with the jeans and back printing, no like or um, side printing. And then the hold on. The next minifigure is a uh, this on is this dude. I like the Hawaiian shirt. I won't focus on. Uh, no side printing, and he's got back printing with like that Hawaiian shirt. He's got a beard and the long hair. Um, another thing I like about this van, come on. Another thing I like about this van is how smooth it is because they don't really expose a lot of studs besides on the top. So I like that. And my overall review of Oh, come on, get the van in there. The overall review, I would say, of this is from 0 to 10, probably a 9.5. I just think it needed, like, a trash can or something. I don't know. It's like, it's like that's why it's like a 9.5. Uh, my favorite thing that came with this is probably the gas pump, the sign, and the car. So this, this, and this. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching this review, and goodbye.